I don't know. I hear it out. <laughs> you're gonna hear the whole dude. This, you know how that sometimes give you an option to skip and then sometimes not. Right. No option to skip. Lately, it's been, it's been a commercial after the commercial that you can skip. <laughs> you. Oh, dude, we're demonetized. I know, I want but Chuck we already have. Here doing. We have two already, I think, this month, this month. so we need All right, to... All right, that was it. That was it. It was oh, quick. if we hit our... It was quick. <laughs> but, well, you can, like, they'll... they'll if you get you. over two in, like, a, in a... They'll just shut you down. Yeah. For my birthday, so, can we not be demonetized? Yeah, well, Ugh. whatever. Actually, being demonetized, like, how long do they... How long do they shut you down for? A couple weeks? Uh, I, how long till I get my money? I don't... I don't break the rules that often. Okay, Richard, so, well... Because, <laughs> like, you know... Next month we got we're gonna we're gonna have a couple weeks off. What's the fiscal period? Do we have to do the uh, <laughs> stuck mode reunion now that we have 150 subscribers? Oh wow! <laughs> Six months later. Wow. When <laughs> that did that was that that was the thing, wasn't it? <laughs> that was the thing. Siri on my watch just came up and went, "Don't do it." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "This." It was like, whoa, 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 whoa. "Anywho." I wonder how long ago Anthony's episode was. It was probably Trouble. close to. Three to six. Trouble. Three to six. Three to six. So happy birthday, trouble. dude. Tommy. Hey, fucking 37. Oh, made it. Oh, made it. Okay, so I did. I've said this. It's so funny that I've said the same phrases on this podcast so many times. I did do a little bit of research. Yeah. Um, And one of the most, because, dude, 37, people don't give a shit. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. 37's nothing. Yeah, well, it's not special in any mm, way. Mm -hmm. If you type in thirty set, like people, yeah. people aren't don't respect it. Yeah, so it's like fifty three or something. Yeah, 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 totally. Like it just means whatever. Anything after what 25, 25, 25. You can rent a car, right? I feel like twenty nine is kind of like all right. Let's fucking go. Oh, get you're getting into the thirty, and then you're get, yeah, I guess. Or so thirties maybe something. So I guess each decade of yeah. of of numbers, but is like kind of things special. that will that will change for you in the better. 37 is not one of the, you know. In fact, but the only <laughs> thing that happens is things get worse. So here's what I've said forever. Okay. When I was in my 20s talking to people who were turning 30, turning 32 or 35, I would always say, because I fucking knew everything. Yeah, yeah. You're not old till you're 37 because then you're almost 40. <gasps> oh, wow. I would tell, I've told that to so many people. And now here I am. That's and that now was your I'm th like that was your thing. Yeah, that was my thing. Oh, and we're there. And now, yeah, it's like okay, okay. So thanks, past Cam. <laughs> so dick. here's here's the fact. Here's the one thing that of all the research that I did that stuck out to me, and I was like, oh, that is kind of interesting and cool that thir it lands on thirty seven. They over the guess who guess who it is. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Take one guess. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Doug Gordon. Um, so, um, he, uh, fuck, he fucked, he fucked it no, all no, up. No, 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 okay. no. Oh, you oh. did research. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Here it is. Here it is. Ready? This, this I thought was the most interesting fact that I learned about three, because there's nothing. No, it's. All there was was like mainly blog posts, uh, mainly women. I don't, you know, just for whatever reason of mm. like talking about the beauty of like being 37 okay you know inspiring other women to not knock Be themselves down yeah. yeah but at 37 you've got this this and, that, and all this other sure thing. and so but i didn't want any of that so the but i got this fact at 37 in the united states you are exactly you have 50 percent of the population is older than you and 50% of the population is younger than you. Really? You so are, I'm like the frosting in an Oreo? Sure. No, because those the evil, equal thicknesses. You're, so, just, you're just... I'm just right in that... Like, you're in the very middle of the age range of the population. You're the middle child. Like hardcore at 37. Huh. There's nothing more... You can't... So... And then there is this little graph... That, that you actually kind of holds me up a little bit. Kind of dope. Because like... 
Because here's the thing. Yeah, what do you feel? With you telling me that factoid? Or just being factoid. 30. Factoid. Um, factoid. I can't tell young people shit. And I also can't tell old people shit. Here, dude, I have the exact. I'm in that little. No, no, no. Nook, dude. No, no, no. Or can I tell them both everything? That's what That's it is. That's the thing? That's what All it right. is, right? Because I'll like, go with that. Because you know it both. You, you were there. I'm you were there, there for both. You're, yeah, you're there I'm for both. I'm equally pissed off at the punk kid. Yeah. But I also love Major Laser. Right. <laughs> right. So like. Dude, and you could do a kick. Like, so, you could do a kick flip. So, yeah, you I can, can still, still do, do a, a kick flip. flip. So, all right. All you right. Should, you should, I like that. You should wait. Be, all right. What's the, how, how much of the population is, like, how many people, how many people under that age or. Oh. Like, how much does it make up? I it's got gotcha. 48, 48, four. Right. Yeah, how many old people are there and how many young people are That's a good question. So it seems like there's obviously more young people because at 30, it, it, it went up to, like the graph ran out at 100. So at 37, there was the same amount of people older than you were, than you to up to 100 as there was younger than you. So there's a, far less older people. Up to 100. Does that make sense? Yeah, I understand that. But like population wise, I wonder what it is. Like, yeah, it really? Didn't, it I, didn't, no, I'm sure it didn't say it that, didn't but give that's the, what I'm interested in. Yeah, it didn't give me that. that I want the facts. Yeah, but you know, I mean, <laughs> so do I. It's a good I want fact. The facts. Mm. So, but how are you feeling at 37? What what do you, do you feel you're in the zone right now? Like, is this a good no. year? No, well, I mean, yeah, okay, so. <laughs> no. I do, no, so I'm busier than I've ever been. Okay, you got it. Yeah. I'm like raising kids, doing yeah. a lot of shit, doing the most I've ever done. Yeah. So I feel good like about accomplished. that. I do like feel like physically I should dial it in a little more. I need to pay more attention, mm. which I think is natural. Yeah. As you get older, you got to fucking oh, do. Yeah. You got to work harder to stay <laughs> healthy. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it just doesn't happen oh, anymore. God. So like that's a thing that like I've put a lot of thought to this weekend. You know, we went up to the mountains and I was like they when they all took naps, I sat out on the porch and just kind of like. No, ponder. Thought about you. Wow, yeah. you, you, pon- you had a fat, yeah, I did. You had a fat yeah. ponder sex. I did have a fat ponder sex. Wow. Did you whittle? Yeah. No. No, no I didn't do it. You know I you- didn't even bring my guitar, to be honest, because I didn't have room in the car. You were whittling yeah. your brain. I was <laughs> I was cobbling shoes out of my brain. <laughs> out of wood. Brains. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. Uh, you, made a, you made a couple of The reason of I said cobbling is because it's from a movie. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> so I was like, all right. People have New Year's resolutions, right? Mm. But, like, this is a new year for me, right? Yeah. This is my new year. Right. So I'm like, fuck, dude. I, You know, I've got kids. I got to really fucking start putting more effort towards health. Yeah. So are you just, you know. Are you thinking longevity? Longevity. And like, energy. Just energy all around. You know what I mean? Longever and longe- longenerity. Longenerity. No. Longenergy. There it is. That was a that's a weird one. Ener- longenergy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Energevity. <laughs> if you will. Either one. Wow. Either one works. How does you do that? Because that's the thing, is that that's like crazy. you need energy as fuck. Dude. Yes, you do. You need You can't bog fuck. down. No. You, dude. Your kids have to bog down before you. Oh, then yeah. you can pull over you, and do you, your thing. You okay. wanna? I think I I get it, dude. I I I'm sure you look at Rubes and you're like, man, I, I just want to walk her down the aisle. I mm-hmm. want to see her graduate from college. And if you fuck up your body, your body's gonna retaliate. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm so worried. My body is starting to retaliate. You're feeling it. I've been pretty docile. And over you're 35. The, I'm 35. Yeah. Yeah. But almost 36, mm-hmm. right? And it's the same. It's all the same. Yeah, nothing has happened in the past two years. I don't think that. Do, do you know at me. what? Do you know what, at what age they say? What fucking age they say is middle age? Do you know what age? Well, it used to be forty, right? Nay, always been this one number. Between this number and another. Really? Number, yeah, they say it's middle age. So thirty-eight. Forty-five, close. Really? Yeah. So I feel I nowadays. Yeah, but that's men, always been. men don't live as that long. That oh. right? Yeah. Heart heart disease. Well, Hard to see. Uh, speaking of, I would acknowledge. I think we should acknowledge yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, I'd like oh, to shout Chris, out like yeah. the little the little charity thing they're doing too. For sure. So. I so that you know it was a it was a really strange thing. So Taylor, I didn't know I didn't know that. It, so we're talking about our our 
fucking homie for 20 plus years. Long time, yeah, man. very supportive, like amazing, yeah. awesome just, character <laughs> in our lives. For another a long time. another person who just really thought we should have made it further. Didn't understand it. why. It yeah, didn't. Yeah, he was there all the time. He so, was there for the inside uh, everything. Yeah, for so, sure. So Chris Chick, um, he it, the guy we just explained. He's he passed away. And um, do you have the charity? Do you know the name of it? Uh, I would look. Uh, I just searched Missy Chick under Sh- GoFundMe. Okay, yeah, okay. Uh, and I'm sure you'll be able to find it there. Chris Chick, Missy Chick. Yeah, you guys know. You yeah. know the chicks. Yeah. Billy Chick, all the chicks. Yeah. yeah and um, 42, man. Yeah. You know, I, I it, it never, it's never... Um, I'm always still at this point, not enough people in my life have died to where I'm like, oh, OK, like I'm OK with it. You Not this well, is what happens. Yeah. It's You've like, accepted that this is what happens. Yeah. I just right. I haven't experienced enough of that to be passive about death. Every time I find out that somebody that I've known on a very fucking close level s- spent many nights in their house, mm-hmm. spent many nights just this close to their face, <laughs> just saying, blah, blah, just going yeah. crazy, um, you know, finding out that those those people are passing away. It's just a, it's, that's because we're at an age where that's not supposed to be happening. I think you're right. If we were 50 or 60, yeah, we'd be like, oh, Don. Yeah. You got Don Jones fucking. Yeah, that happened. But if you look at how old we are, we've seen way too many. Right. We've seen way too many deaths. You know what I mean? Already. But we're not old enough for it to be like what you said. Like, yeah, I don't think my parents really are even still cool with it. Like Sally from high school 40 years ago. It's still sort of baffling for sure. No, I know it's it's the ultimate. It's it's a sobering dose of reality. Reality. Yeah. Yeah. And it's fucked up. So, and so he was through my mind a lot this weekend. Yeah. I was thinking about Chris a lot this weekend. And we talked about him randomly. We haven't brought yeah. him up once, I don't think, on the podcast. But no. you randomly brought him up. A couple weeks ago. Last week. Or last week, yeah. And then it happened. Yeah, And Taylor so was like, weird. did we talk about him? I was like, yeah. yes, we did. We yeah. did talk about him. Just real quick, because yeah. you were... You were it's like him and Tim, or like how they rock out. And yes, shit. Yes, yeah, yeah. And that was a private conversation. Right. But it yeah. wasn't. But it was last week. We were talking about him. Yeah. Yeah. So bizarre. Yeah, uh, he was super, super, super awesome guy. Very he was supportive just of positive all of us. as fuck. Yeah. Always. Well, he's like he's a he was a coach. Yeah, and at like uh, Saguaro and, and great Chandler. Coach Chandler, but like a coach that fucking they championship coach. Great like, guy. He was fucking the guy. Go donate to his uh, funeral fund. Help his family out. Missy Chick, Chris Go Chick. Fund me. Go fund me. Um, you might be able to see it on my uh, stories. Uh, no, I think it's on my Facebook. If yeah, shared. It. Okay, yeah, yeah, I shared it. Yeah, so go do that, please. Um, Rest in like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe to the podcast as well. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we passed 150 subscribers. Dude, we, we passed 150 <laughs> subscribers. Yes, that's pretty. That's it. Took 60 episodes. This is episode 60. 60? That's kind of that's kind of yeah. fucked up, people. It's wild. <laughs> I remember my last birthday on the pod. We were in the garage. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! I, I wrote you that beautiful song. Yeah, yeah. Hobby Boo Boo is Hobby there. Hobby Boobs. Yep. Yeah. And um, I guess the difference was um, this is more comfortable. Yeah. Oh, do do you did you the the AC just kicked on? It feels great. Yeah. The other thing is I had money back then too. I was thinking <laughs> about that, so I presented you with gifts. Get. I presented with dicks you. gifts. Ah, that's what I wanted to say. <laughs> uh, no gifts, but I have. I have. I got a couple of things lined up for you, which is including this oh, one thing. Okay. <coughs> and he kind of fucked and ruined it already. But I'm gonna hand you the phone, and I'm gonna put it on. Is this a cameo? It's not gonna be a cameo. Oh. It's just gonna be a of um, sorts. It's going. Well, yeah, yeah. It's gonna be a speakerphone call, and I'm very interested to see how this turns out. But go ahead. Okay. So do I put him yep. up to? Yeah. Put him up to the mic. He, no. He ghosted you. <laughs> no. <laughs> of all people. He had, he had three minutes to do it, and then he fucking... Oh, my God. Are you kidding? He probably got too, he probably he probably got, got he got too the excited. Phone like, here he is, here he is, here he is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hello? Can you hear me? I can hear you. <laughs> Dude. Uh, sorry, my fat phone hit the wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> Your fat phone hit the wrong. I thought we thought maybe you dropped it in the toilet because you were so excited. 
No, that was Ben during our draft. He dropped his phone into the mop bucket during our draft. <laughs> oh. oh, I knew I heard it somewhere. Uh, that's a Dude, story no up, one's bro? heard. Cameron Michael Cook, happy birthday, bro. Thanks, brother, man. I'm glad you're here with me. Is, is it the big 3-6? Three, <laughs> oh, three, he's, three, that, three, he's, seven. he's really fucking up. Wow. Dude, Richard should have been like two grades below you, huh? Yeah, either I'm really dumb or he's really smart. The bottom, I think. Wow. So is this oh. like live on air? Like you're on, baby. You're, you're live on air. Say hi to everybody. Yeah. Dude, what's up? This is Doug Gorley, <laughs> aka the biggest celebrity in Old Town from 04 to 08. <laughs> oh Thank you. Yes, yes. What are you doing? I just, I just want to say the honor is all mine to be on this broadcast. I appreciate it. But I just wanted to get my two cents in and wish Hammy Bone a happy 37th birthday. Oh. And, uh, you know, I just want to let you know that you have a sick ass Paul Reed Smith, and I love you guys to death. And I'm <laughs> embarrassed and don't know what else to say. Okay. I fucking love you, Doug. Thank you, man. That's awesome. That's all we did need, your, Doug. Did your wife get you something? Something nice? Yes, she did. Nice. Dude. I can't tell you what it is though. It's X-rated. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh my god. That's awesome. No. No, she didn't. I'm just kidding. She did. Okay. Nice. No, I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, Doug, that's no, good. We love you. All right. Well, thank you for the call. I appreciate it. You guys made a forty-year-old loser's day, so thank you. Okay. All right. Be look out. Be on the lookout for this episode. Oh, dude, I will. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna watch it eighty-five times. <laughs> that's how we get the views up, dude. <laughs> No, I, still, I, still, I, still, I, still, I still watch all the rest, but I think my, my episode is like 225 views. I'm pretty sure like 100 of those are mine. So. <laughs> God anyway, bless right. you, Doug. That's good. Right, go do it and just uh, just uh, thank, thank your lucky stars. You were at seven years old and had Chuck Carly's yell at you for after burn. Oh, I th- yeah, I think I, I th- it's one of my th- thoughts every morning when I wake up. Oh, God, Doug. Thank you. We love you. Love you, Dougie. Uh, love you guys. Later. Bye. So, okay. yeah, so, Doug, so Doug called, like I told you, he called me. He wanted, he wanted to wish you a happy birthday like three hours ago because he <laughs> thought we were hanging out. Um, he left me a voicemail. He just goes, afterburner. That's the only <laughs> that's thing. All he said. That's all he says in the fucking. <laughs> and if you don't, okay, so he tells this story. If you go back, find the episode. If you are like new to the podcast, you're new to the channel. That Doug Gorley, the guy who who was just on the phone, we did an episode with him like thirty episodes ago or something, and it was it was hilarious. Yeah. he absolutely fucking killed it. He tells this story about Afterburner, and it is is absolutely insane <laughs> that he still will every get, single he'll, he'll detail, just, <laughs> but he'll he'll just leave me a fucking voicemail yeah. that's just Afterburner. It's because he's he's into it. Yeah, he's into it. And it's so ingrained. That's just. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, okay. It's, so, it's funny shit. Dude. Okay. Doug's so. Good, that's, that was sweet. Okay. Are you ready? I don't know. Okay. So you did mention this um, to Ben right before we, we shot. I'm going to list because I think this is kind of interesting. <gasps> oh, here it comes. I'm going to list people who are born on the same day. Okay. Okay, so you know of one. I know of Clint Eastwood. Okay, he's he's top of the list. Yep. Top of the fucking list. You ready? I'm ready. Brooke Shields. Ooh. Brooke Shields. What do you think about Brooke Shields? I think she's hot, but brouch. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I think I think it's just a little too Eugene Levy for me. You know what I mean? Yeah. A little bit. She looks. See, She's hot though. But she didn't. Mm. I don't. I feel like. I feel like the last picture I saw of her, I was like, ah, she did not age, age well. That well. Mm. I was like, because she was fucking smoke show. She, she was a. She yeah. was a dime. Yeah, yeah. Piece, dude. For sure. And then all of a sudden, I was like, okay. And it's not that her brows are bushy like Eugene's, but like, I don't know. I feel like she's just has maybe okay, like here, a mad face. Here we go. Mm, maybe they are a little bit. They're a little bush. Yeah, okay. They're a little bush. I think that's the only thing. She looks all right. Yeah. But I'm like, damn. For sure. That's not what I remember. Okay, so Brooke Shields. Yeah, I like her. Colin Farrell. Yeah. He's a. You knew him? Yeah, I knew him. Here. Okay, Walt Whitman. <laughs> you know Walt Whitman, right? Oh, uh, Walt. Walter. Shit. Still <laughs> so owes break, me fucking breaking bad? six bucks. 
Um, let's see. Leah Thompson, no clue. What? Whoa, whoa. Leah Thompson. Yeah, Michael J. Fox's mom in Back to the Future, bro. Oh, is that who uh, it is? Oh, yeah. yeah. You're right. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Yeah, dude, dude. I don't know celebs, dude. I'm oh, so, I'm man. Surprised. Okay, okay. Oh, she's rad. Yeah. I like her. Does he try to fuck her in that movie? Well, that's... He does. No, he doesn't. She tries, she tries to, to fuck, fuck him because she thinks his name's Calvin Klein because <laughs> of his underpants, and he like saved like that's right. Okay, she, like yeah. Dude, oh, she man. goes Calvin, and he's in the. It's bed. written all over your underwear. Oh god! I and she's like trying to fuck him. I wanted to yeah. fuck her bad. Yeah, didn't you? Oh yeah, she was hot she back was so in the day. Hot. God damn and it! And she aged pretty well. Like she, she still pretty much looks no, the same. She does. Yeah. She does look the same. God. Calvin. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Chris Elliott. Yeah. That's the hand guy. Uh, my germs. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it is? <laughs> yeah. Dude, you're right. That's the I hand fucking guy. love him. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh, my God, dude. Cabin Boy. Do you remember <laughs> Cabin Boy? Yeah. God, it was so good. Okay, Chris Elliott. You, you guys got. You guys know the names. Oh, this is fun. Have you ever had a white head on your eyeball, Mary? <laughs> <laughs> so gnarly. Woogie Woganowski. Okay. <laughs> the, you're going to love this one. This one. You love this kind of stuff. You know Joe Namath? <laughs> oh yeah, the the fucking <laughs> soccer player. <laughs> it was a quarterback. Or, oh yeah, he's a quarterback. For okay, the, for the American football Jets. Or something? <laughs> I don't know. He was. I think he was the Jets, or I don't fucking know. Um, yeah, you love this stuff. Goddamn. <laughs> Tom gosh. Berenger. Yeah, he's the substitute. There was like five of them. Oh my God. The movie The Substitute? Is he? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. He was a major league dude. Oh, my. You're right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, he's. he's yes. Dude, yeah. He's like the guy with all the wisdom yeah. in Major League. Yeah. Holy. It's like his last shot. How do you remember his name? This is fucking turning out way better than I thought. <laughs> Wow. I there, have so much useless knowledge. This of like, is good. No, this is good. Because there's there's one name in here that I was like, holy shit. This, that's kind of cool. But we'll get there. Oh, it's it's the next one. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Did you know that Don Amici had the same birthday? I you? did, actually. Oh, shit. Yeah, I you, forgot about that. That's, that's awesome. That's crazy. Yeah. And I was like, that can't be the right one. Dr. It, Wainwright. Dude, it straight up is yeah. Don Amici. Yeah, dude. That's fucking dope, And dude. that shit's fucking wild. That is. Did you, right. fi did you figure that out because of Dom or what? Yeah. yeah. I'm sure. Yeah, it's, Dom it's, told me. Yeah. yeah, at some point, Dom was like, yeah, it's mm -hmm. my... Fucking my, my great granddaddy. Yeah. Uh, Archie Panjabi. Punjabi. Mm. Oh, Skip it. Yeah. No, he's, no. A great, he's a great Indian That's actor. A, it's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> nice day. <laughs> he swung for the fences. <laughs> Peter Peter Yarrow. Mm -mm. No clue. No. He He's holding a git fiddle. So okay. this is the guy. You, you guys have the same birthdays. It looks like... um. Oh, he played uh, piano in Simply Red. Oh really? I don't know who. What all? All, all, all of those. Okay. Oh, dude. Uh, walk a flock of flame. Killing it. Oh yeah. You and walk a flock of flame, dude. Come on. Yep. You got. I mean, how many? Similar I'm 37, so I can be like, fuck yeah, I knew Waka. Dude, walk a walk on. <laughs> flock of walk <-a. laughs> What like Fozzie Bear? Yes. <laughs> you guys are a lot. Of, uh, Have you ever heard walk a flock of flame? <laughs> What like Fozzie Bear? Okay, hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Um, those are those are the notables. Okay. Now the other thing that I checked out, which was kind of cool, is that these people and I like. So I the reason why I like this little section is because for me, I was thinking, okay, where am I at in my life? Like when I turn thirty six, I'm gonna do this for myself. Mm. Where am I at my life at 36? And then who are the other people that turned 36 this year? And where, <laughs> where are they? <laughs> You're right. just going to compare. Oh, that's my day. whole That's, dude, your that's whole my thing. whole fucking thing, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. I just constantly fucking beat myself up. <laughs> you're you're, you're, you're going to find the five that are like killing it. And then you're going to rush to find the people who are fucking bums. And you're going to feel all right. With where you're I'll at. Be in the Is middle. that the thing? I it's like when you find out someone passed away, you're like, you need to know how they did so you know it can't happen to you. Yeah. <laughs> Is well, it kind of like that? Actually, now I almost always want to know why people passed away. Because if there are people that I know, usually they're younger. And I yeah. think it has to do with drugs or alcohol. Mm -hmm. Every yeah. time. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And that's just, you know, I feel like I escaped somehow. 
Like, I, I OD'd several times and just, like, somehow I'm still here. Yeah, there's a reason for that. Okay, so I don't even think you know this guy. I happen to know this guy because I watch YMH, which is uh, your mom's house podcast. Oh, yeah. And they kind of dog on this guy a little bit. But this guy is fucking killing it, actually. His name's Darman. You heard of this guy? Dar D-A-R-M-A-N? D-H-A-R. Okay. Yeah, M-A-N-N. Darman. Mm -hmm. He puts these... God, I almost want you... Hmm. Yeah, look it up. Uh, yeah, we could, but we'll totally get flagged. This guy's, this guy, there, his shit's doing so well. Basically, it's like almost so. Darman, D H A R M A N N, and you could probably go to like the most recent one. But the best way I can describe this is like you're almost trying to like teach children how to like act in the world. Mm. And they just do, it's so dumb. Like, it's the dumbest fucking thing ever. And YMH does the most outstanding job of fucking ripping this guy up. Oh, baby. I'm so excited. I think I know what it is. Oh. You know how badly I've wanted this bag. I want you to have everything you want in life, babe. Yes, yeah, probably, Wait, yeah, this sounds What good, is this? Though. Kate Spade? I can't be caught wearing Kate Spade. I told you I wanted a Louis Vuitton bag. A Louis Vuitton bag. Hold on, hold on. Pause right now. that. Okay, so it's going to go through. So, the, okay, that gives you a good gist of, like, how the acting is, right? So it's mm. not good acting, meaning that it's like, I told you I wanted right. Louis Vuitton big. Right. Right? And so it'll be, like, lessons like you're walking through, you know, uh, like, the hallways at your school and someone will bump into you and they'll yeah. be like, hey, watch it, pib squeak. You, you're so ugly. Right. What kind of jeans are you wearing? <laughs> and then they'll be like, that's not how you should actually be. That's not cool to do. Mm -hmm. Like, it's that kind of a shit. This guy is killing it. How many views on that? Uh, 60,000 million? Yeah, I've stumbled across some of that stuff. Yes. And I'm like, it's all... <laughs> Holy that, that's what I'm saying. It's so it's so beyond anything you could ever Wait, imagine. What's the demographic that watches this? It's I'd okay. So some of it, I do believe, goes into like schools. Like they watch it in school. You know what I mean? Instead uh, of like dragging a cart in, they can just go to to Darman's fucking page, and they can be if they if they find a top. There's probably stuff on coronavirus yeah. and like. Uh, racism and sexism like bullies it, like all that shit all those scripted we, things like the bully kid and then like the couple that's breaking up because she caught him cheating what do they call or, those something something specials what do they call those uh like that we would watch them as kids there's something like after school special after school special yeah. it's like that kind of vein okay guys mm. we need to all find jesus and like become real clean and start doing shit like this. I got Birkenstock. That's how you fucking make money. Thirty-seven million views. Yeah, Cam's got Berkey stock. I got. I'm, I'm already on the. Cam's right getting I'm track. Feeling the holy, literally, I'm feeling the Holy Spirit. Yeah, the Holy Spielman. Is that what this is? Though? The Holy is like Spielman. Like Christian shit or? It's not stuff? necessarily Christian, but it's it's very I just stuff? scenarios. Christian, that... is this Christian stuff? What is this Christian stuff? <laughs> Uh, you are also so that guy is straight bawling out of his mind, right? It's Thirty-two million, and he's thirty-six. Yeah, that was the point of it. Or thirty-seven. Uh, uh, Chris Hemsworth. Yeah, you guys same yep. age. Yep. Chad Wild Clay. Hmm. No clue. Hmm. Uh, Future, the hip hop artist. Future. Never heard of him. Not that cool, are you, Cam? Whoa. You haven't heard of Future? Mask off. No. <laughs> it's not shit that you would like. <laughs> I can tell you that right. What now. is it? It's auto tune and synthesizers. Yeah, it's that kind mm -hmm. of hip hop. Yeah. yeah, yeah, shit that you cloud rap. Uh, yeah, kind of. Yeah, I mean a version of it. Not the, I... Lazy ass motherfucking cloud rap. I like some. I like some features. There's songs. some future because some of the fucking beats you can't deny almost makes you want to just get going. But you and <laughs> no, I, I no. <laughs> you and Mila. I have plenty of guilty pleasure. You and Mila Kunis. Kunis. Mm. Oh okay. yeah. Yeah, bro. All this right. this one I thought was dope, dude. You and Donald Glover. Nice. Dude, I Fuck love yeah, Donnie dude. Glove. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> He's the best, right? Wait, junior or senior? <laughs> 
Wait, is the other is there a that, That's actually a legit question. <laughs> is it Childish Gambino yeah, childish or is Gambino? it fucking Lethal Weapon? <laughs> Who are we talking about? If he was Danny, the- that's Danny Glover. <laughs> oh yeah, what did you say? I said Donald. Donald sorry. Oh, <laughs> sorry. No, no. It, yeah, yeah. So if it was Danny Glover, <laughs> that, it. we would be in a parallel universe. Yeah, we would. <laughs> <laughs> he also rad Also fucking very rad But Donald Glove Yeah, yeah You and Childish sure. Gambini Yeah Is it Dumbo um, Drop? <laughs> uh, Amber Rose Right Great tits Right It's Kanye Yeah she's Zach, right? flump Great All the things God she's kind she's of She's hot for sure She's kind of in my wheelhouse Yeah yeah <laughs> um, You want to hear something You know what I'm about to fuck We're about to get unsubscribed Okay oh, That's okay man. though Cause okay. you you had a you had a you got a story, dude. It's not really a story, but it is um, an update. Okay, hold on. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm recording you. No, no, no. no, no. no. Oh, I'm recording <laughs> you because we're, I need we're, to. Because we're, we're not recording, recording you already. This. No, my brother called me again. Let me just text him real quick. Oh, he did. Okay. Yeah. No, but you can keep going. Just no. don't let this interrupt what you're saying. Well, is he gonna? Does he want to call in? Well, I don't want to put him. I don't want to sandbag him. Yeah. You know, Doug there can, are people I'll you, sandbag yeah. and people I won't, and my brother's not one of them. Definitely not. You know what I'm saying? Christian's not getting sandbagged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll be like, what the f- fuck? <laughs> and then he'll be like pissed yeah, yeah, and yeah. say, I could have done that better. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. That's anyway, okay. Need I say more? No, so a, a kind of a, a weird development. Not weird. It's honestly like the best thing ever. Um, I'm seeing somebody. Oh, oh all right. So oh, does she look no. like Amber Rose? The grimy stuff is over, so Alex. So straight up, Alex. <laughs> Tinder and Bumble, no longer even on my phone. And, oh! I, and I'm going to tell you this right now. So this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Reverse. Yeah. You're seeing someone, and you were you deleted those apps. I deleted the apps off. Man, my phone. you really. Dude, she didn't even go for it. Here's the fucking. You know what's the best thing about it? Mm. She didn't even fucking even for one second tell me that i need to do anything we're not like together together even though we kind of are like she's you can get those apps back do do of course but (laughs) um, in the cloud still yeah it's in the cloud (laughs) dude save all those messages (laughs) (laughs) no but um i i it's it's a it i'm not gonna say too much about it i will i do want to tell you this though because it is such a lovely thing that is happening right now yeah it's a person that i've known for several years oh is it someone i know not really okay that's what's kind of cool about the whole thing you don't you don't know taylor does we're not gonna play the game right now (laughs) no 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 we're not gonna i'll tell you i'll tell you later i've heard Um, the name you've heard the name okay um, she was a part of my life for a, 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 a moment uh, a couple years ago, and we sort of have rekindled the flame, and I've gotten to hang out with her for a couple of nights uh, over the last like week, and it has been so beautiful. She is probably the most like genuine, kind-hearted human beings I've ever met in my entire life and really deserves like good in her life so i have made it very clear that like you put the disclaimer out not oh not a di- no you've edited the disclaimer the disclaimer is more just like the you dick know slammer? i'm kind the, of you've edited the dick disclaimer. i'm just kind of i'm not she just i'm she gets it though she knows all i dude she hasn't pressured me to do anything that's the thing that I've, i'm really loving about everything that's going on and i just i just want to share that real quick I'm seeing no, that's is good. She, I'm seeing, does she listen? Uh, she does sometimes. Oh, she does sometimes. She probably uh, randomly probably wouldn't hear this one. She doesn't listen to enough of them to, I think, be like an avid listener or whatever. Uh, yeah, but You'd um, be surprised. But, but um, I'm happy. You know, in that realm of my life, there's something that there's like some light at the end of the tunnel where I feel like there's maybe a person that sort of fits with me. Cause she is so good that it there's it 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 fixes something in me. Do you know what I mean? She's so good. Does it make you want to be a better person? <laughs> yeah, like straight up as good as it gets. Movie. <laughs> <laughs> you know where he says that? 
Because you make me want to be a, a better man. man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's putting bacon in the goddamn bag. Yeah, dude. It's, it's his fingers <laughs> suck, dude. I hate his fingers. How he fucking <laughs> Congratulations, yeah. Richard. Thank you. Thank yeah, that's you. awesome. Yeah, so I'm not going to be getting, I'm not going to, we're going to be, we're just going to be fucking straight funny because we're funny, not talking about You know what's funny is that what? when Taylor was like, does she listen? And you were like, sometimes. I'm like, well, that doesn't sound very good. But you were talking about the podcast. Oh, and yes. And I thought he was, like, yeah, in just general. generally. Does she listen? <laughs> she does. Sometimes she does. Yeah. She a good listener? The, uh, well, no. You know, sometimes. You know what? It's okay. <laughs> I'm the, like. <laughs> she She is a good listener. Good. She's, she's a good. She's good. a really good, really, really good listener. <laughs> That's good. Um, Sexually. <laughs> she's. <laughs> She listens. Uh, Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Once everything really gets good, like, and I can like be solid about it, then I can be open and talk about our sexual. Unless she's like Richard, I don't really feel comfortable. With and it. you're not, and you're not looking. You you don't have a relationship goal. You're just no. going with the flow. No, I'll tell you this. It's like I want to be with her. Like I want to be okay. a- around her. Sure. I just want to be near her and like have experiences with her. And does she know you're uh, like... married still? Yeah. Oh. She knows everything. When are you going to get divorced? Soon. Should. Very, very, very soon. Actually, it's 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 kind of come to a head where it needs mm. to sort of be handled at this point. Mm. <laughs> Can't really keep it going much longer. You know, mm. I'm sort of I've run out of steam and um, mm. I've run out of compassion for the potential results sure and that's kind of where i'm at you know I, I i think a lot of it had to do with i was worried about what the result would be if i pursued you know and finalized a divorce i was worried about i guess fully fully being open about it is i was just worried uh what she would do to herself potentially yeah. feeling like there was just sort of like there was nothing left you mm-hmm. know and that's just so not true. First of all, it almost I would I would because the reality of the situation is that I think if she really looked at it like the way that I've looked at it is even if everything was perfect. Right. And she and I were in like these really good places. I think there's been so much damage that has been done over the years, even if we were both in like the best places we wouldn't be able to make it work. Mm. There's just not a possibility because there's been so much damage that has accrued over the years that to not even acknowledge some of the past um, things that we've done to each other, you would have to be such a Buddhist. Like we would, you would have to be be so spiritually fucking centered to not bring it up ever again. Right. And I just don't see that ever happen. You know what I mean? So it's like, Uh you might at one point in your life, you never know. It, yeah, I mean, it, it's it's possible to have two people be so fucking like good within themselves at the exact same time to be able to endure the shit that we've done to each other is just like not a possibility. So the it is a possibility, but in my mind, it just doesn't seem possible, and it's not even something that I'm considering. I I am very much considering this person. Yeah, this other because here's the other thing: the hourglass. Yeah, the sand is dropping. Yo. Dude, that is so goddamn true. I feel that hard. Yeah. I'm like, I've told you this in the past, yeah. like, and 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 not recent past. Mm-hmm. It's like I do want. I I like to fuck. I mean, it's good, <laughs> but it's not satisfying. Like, it's right. not fulfilling in no. any way. It's a you, dose. Yeah, it's a dose. You nut, you get out of there, and you're yeah. like, wow, what the fuck? And then like yeah. the story I told last week. It's like, that sucks, dude. Those experiences are not fucking great anyways. You know what I mean? When you have a, when you have your person, there's this consistency there that you know is going to be there every time. You wake up, you look over and you're like, fuck it. Can I just, I just want to get your honest reaction. Cause I honestly don't feel like you remember this person. Cause I don't think I really. Yeah. I would say the name and I can. No, I don't think you No, It's not that this, this is her right here. I'm just going to show you the picture. of Gloria is it Gloria. Wow. (laughs) Do you remember her? Yeah. Oh, is this the person? Yeah. Oh, it is? The shower after, and she... No. No. <laughs> no. That's not Something that, that was a different one. That's a different one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Give me that. Uh, I'll show you again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give it to you. Look at This is... The, so she's, a, so she's like a part-time model. Yes, you need to look at it closer. Yeah, because I'm 37, my eyesight's going. 
I think you might be able to scroll to scroll to the right. You'll see another picture of her. Diz I am. Yeah, she's a beauty, right? Yeah. She's a, he, the crazy thing about it is that she is so goddamn beautiful, but she is the, so sweet. Like she's the sweetest thing ever and she is just wants people to be good and it's actually put her in a lot of really unfortunate situations because when you are so trusting kind, and kind yeah people you get fucked people take advantage the fuck mm -hmm. out of you mm -hmm. and she has been taken advantage of yeah, quite a bit mm. and in fact like if i'm being really honest about it like the first time we kind of had this experience like a similar one that we're having right now i almost took advantage of her niceness do you know what I mean? Because mm. I wasn't there emotionally at all, but I may have originally let her think that I was. Ah. So she got sort of emotionally mm. invested where I wasn't quite there. That's happened to you, though, probably. Yeah. I bet that's happened to you before. Yeah. I mean, it happened with Lizzie. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> that, that was the one. Chicken that... Booties exclusive. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's the that's the only gal in the last. They kind of took you for a ride. Yeah, she took me for a ride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ride. Uh, yeah. yeah. God, I want to say just like so, later. Yeah, and then just and then just was like, you know, she's such a free. You spirit. were like, ah. I was like, wow, that hurt. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah. um, it, it happens, you know, I fucking I put myself in that position. She was very open and honest with me. Lizzie was, you know, and like told me exactly where she sort of was with things. And I was fucking crazy to think that she, mm -hmm. that she would be prepared to take on anything that was, you know, me and three kids. So, um, I and mean, married. I, I quickly <laughs> realized with that, like I, the initial hurt of like her just being like, I can't see you anymore. Like went away rather quickly because I, I I fully understood. I mm. wasn't. She didn't trick me. She didn't nothing. She was very open. Um, but anyways, like going back to this gal, it's like how old is she? This one, my age. Mm. Yeah, she's our well our age. Any kids? She have any kids? Yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah, she's got some good. Kids. Yeah, and she's perfect. She's going to school for a really uh, amazing career. Brady bunch baby. She is. Uh, uh, she's <laughs> she's smart. She's attractive. She is uh, considerate. Gosh, she's so considerate. Well, I love it. So be well, real nice good, to her, man. dude. I'm gonna. I, I told my dad, I was like, I really just don't want to fuck this one up. You know, like I met this. And what did he say? He goes, "You want to know what he says?" I do. He, th this. Because I've heard you say that. I want to hear what he said. <laughs> so I go, Dad. Hey, I'm seeing someone, right? Because okay. Oh, oh, oh. The, uh, okay. So this is what happened. So I went over there. Like, uh, I don't know, like four or five nights ago or whatever. And two years ago, the parking was different. So I parked in a spot where I normally would park and you cannot park there. Right. So I, I went parked. We, we went up and um, I said goodnight to her for the night. And then when I came back down, my car was gone. Nice. Ooh. Got towed. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, damn. And she goes, your car full on got towed. She goes, where were you parked? I go right there. I go, I parked there before. <laughs> she goes, no, rules have changed. Nice. So my car got towed. She didn't really have much going on the next day. Because I wanted, this was at 4.30 in the morning. I was nice. like, we could go get my car right now, you know? She's like, not a chance. Impound fucking downtown? No, impound. Scottsdale or something? On the west side. Oh, okay. And she was like, not a chance. I want to go to bed. Yeah, fuck. She goes, just take my car. Hello. And you take the car. I had to. This is on a Sunday night. I had to, you know, take Charlie to school Monday morning, all that stuff. So she's like, "Just take my car." <laughs> and then, um, <laughs> God damn it! And she's like, uh, you know, in the afternoon, you'll just like bring the car back. We'll go get your car out of impound. Blah blah blah. And she's like, "I'm gonna pay for it." And I was like, "No, you're not." Because she's like, "I should have told you that there was the parking was dipping." I was like, "Why?" I was like, "I should have saw the signs." She's that kind of person. Mm. I'm gonna pay for it. She, Your she, car got towed. It's my fault. Sounds like <laughs> Al, sounds like Alex. Yeah, <laughs> uh, she ended up paying for it. Oh man. No, but I I Venmoed her half, and then I'm taking her out um, to um, City Hall. 
on nice. Friday. There you oh, go. that's gonna be like six hundred dollars. Yeah, so. <laughs> impound was two fifty three. She's gonna look so. I just know her, and she's gonna look so good. Yeah, you guys are gonna cannot walk through there. wait. You gonna wear your Vans and fucking camo or fuck what? yeah, dude? No, dude, I'm gonna wear some fucking slacks. life. Your life rip shirt. Dude, I'm gonna wear my life rip sweatshirt. <laughs> Um, oh, she's gonna look so good. She's so yummy, dude. You know, okay, anyways, yeah. uh, I'm just like, <laughs> I'm such a fag, you know? <laughs> uh, jokes, right? So you came home oh, in her oh. car and you're like, Dad, I met someone. He's like, Yeah, is that her car in the fucking parking lot? He goes, Whose fucking car is that? <laughs> and I go, Oh, I'm seeing someone. And so I was telling him, I was like, Oh, I was like, Somebody that I have seen in the past. I go, You actually never met her mom, did for a second. But um, he goes, He goes, <sighs> He like readjusts. He <laughs> yeah. goes, Okay. He goes, um, After I had just like sang beautiful comments about this person sure you know, i was like i said all the things that i just said to you guys right <laughs> he goes he goes let's just think about this for a second and i go okay he goes he goes what he goes what kind of catch are you mm-hmm. <laughs> and i go mm-hmm. he goes uh you're unemployed he goes <laughs> you have three kids he goes, you live at your parents' house? He goes, what do you have to offer this person? <laughs> That's why I asked. And I go, <laughs> he goes, he goes, you're charming. He goes, you're 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 like you're good looking. You know, you're you're funny and like you're engaging. He goes, but what he goes, women need a little bit of like stability. And he's like, you have none of that. <laughs> My sister was right there. Oh, perfect. Yeah, and she's just having a blast. And I go, I go, luckily and fortunately for me, this person knows me and knows what's All going on. I go, I'm fucking, I go, I'm willfully unemployed, by the way. I could work at fucking Arby's. Do you know what I mean? I could. You have a job at Arby's, all of a sudden, now I'm employed. Like, that means anything. I'm trying to fucking do something right, yeah. that I enjoy. You're trying to build something, yeah. Which, by the way, I'll tell you about this, dude. So, remember when I tried, when I did that audition, I was going to do that audition thing for, like, the guitar player, and then Taylor was helping yeah. Alex's brother, and Taylor shot it, and, like, you know. He didn't get it 7, either. 7,000 so. HPD, you know. I was like, oh, great. Um, I just shot mine on the iPhone. Um, well, at the same time I applied for the agency, so I won't say the name of the agency, but there's this agency that, um, you know, just like a standard agency that does, you know, auditions for film and TV and, and whatever. And even still shots, which I said, I'm not doing any of that with my big fucking gorilla tits. Uh, (laughs) Uh, so, you know, it's been months since that. And I remember I just like casually said to Anna, I was like, what the fuck ever happened with that? Yeah. I go, you sent me the forms. I filled them out and I fucking, you know, sent it out. And they heard no nothing. Yeah. And Anna was like, yeah, that is kind of weird. She goes, but I didn't like um, um, follow up. No, no, no. Uh, when you recommend. um, What's that called? A recommendation? Not a recommendation. Referral. Referral. Thank you, Tay Tay. Tay Tay is falling asleep. No, I'm not. I'm uh, a- referral. <laughs> <laughs> I still have a couple other things I need to no, do with I'm you. Not falling Don't asleep. fall asleep yet. I, I still have a couple things. Leaning. Okay, okay. He's leaning. Um, leaning. Uh, referral. Okay, so Anna's like, oh, I didn't refer you. And so she goes, let me just do that real quick. And she just hopped on her phone right then and there and just referred me. Mm-hmm. And then within like five minutes, the. The company, the the agency, fucking messaged me. Weird. It was like, hey, here, do this thing, and it's another self tape thing, and send it in. And um, it was a like I had to. Uh, it was a script for something. They just wanted me to do the slate, which the slate is just. Hi, my name is Richard Carlise. I'm 35 years old. I weigh right. 250 pounds. I got what? fucking. <laughs> I have ape tits and a long, a long second toe. And I live in Phoenix, Arizona. Like they want the slate. Two, two long seconds. Two toes. long, two long toes and, <laughs> and two ape tits. <laughs> um. So I mean, I could fill. I could feed a pack of gorillas. Is it a pack? What is it? Pack of gorillas, right? They call them a family, don't they? A family of gorillas. We better find that out now because <laughs> what's a f- it's not a pack. Hey Siri, 
It's a family. I hey, Siri, what's a pack of gorillas called? Oh. Series over. Uh, <laughs> I think it's a family. I don't know. Dude, you great, so? great apes. I think all great apes. Pride? No. no. It's lions. It's not a murder. <laughs> not a murder. We've done that. It's not we've, a pod. We've been down this road before. <laughs> What's well, a grouping? A grouping of orangutans. <laughs> also a family. Also. Also a family. And troops. Yeah. Okay. Troops all right, of troops. gorillas. All right, troops yeah. of gorillas. So I guess gorillas live in groups called troops. troops. <laughs> gorillas live I can group. rap the Wikipedia, dude. Oh my god, let's hear it. Uh, rap it, Cam. Rap it, Cam. Uh, <laughs> gorillas live in groups called troops. Uh, troops tend to be made one adult male has sailed across the civil back. Multiple adult females got the back. Pick it off spring like you never was a thing. Uh. <laughs> wow, dude, that kind of hit hard. That was it. That was dude. bumping. Yeah, that sounded was like it. future. Yeah, it was future. <laughs> Was that too fast for future? Though? Um, dude, yeah, that's yeah. that's futures. I could have used the auto tune. Future, that's, future. that's futures future album. <laughs> oh, 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 poor guy. Dumb. Okay. Okay. Troops. Anyway, um, um, so, so oh, oh, oh. you're like your dad's like yeah yeah yeah. No, no, no. Oh, the audition thing. <laughs> and is like let We've me fix to, that. Yeah. They sent it back to you. Yeah 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 yeah. You they, sent in the new one. So they sent me this script. Uh huh. That was hilarious, dude. The script was this. It was, it was, uh, you know that five o'clock tired you feel? Yeah, yeah. Neither do we. It was probably three. It was, it, th this was the whole script. Neither do we. <laughs> Balance bar for energy that lasts. That's it. So I did Good the, job, man. I did the slate. I did, thank you, thank you. And then I did that, but I did it fucking, dude, me preparing for like a roll. I did that script, but like really trying <laughs> you know what i mean <laughs> you like know that three do sentences. it, do it you know, for us man you know that tired feeling you feel at 5 p.m no that's not what it was it's like do you know that five o'clock feeling yeah you know that five o'clock tired feeling that you feel at 5 p.m you know when you're tired <laughs> i don't remember it but it was something like that and then i was like balance bar and they see here's the thing here's the thing that got me it goes for energy that lasts right one sentence i thought it should be for energy comma for energy no yeah for energy comma. no wait what was it balance bar for energy that lasts for energy that lasts i thought there should be a comma in there why because i wanted to maximizing every <laughs> single second i just thought it was be, because like i was thinking about every commercial i've ever for seen energy that lasts. that lasts. Oh, you should. You want? Do you want me to get you a, a referral? Yeah, I'll do it all day, dude. You should refer. You should be referred. Is it just okay. voice acting, or is it a? I. You would be good at voice acting. You would be good at voice acting. That's a crazy thing, dude. You. You are better than most voice actors, and here you are constructing. <laughs> you shouldn't be constructing. You should be making two hundred fifty k. Voice just acting. going fish or friends, not food. Yes. Yeah. You should. No. You just didn't. Who do I talk to? Anna? No. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know. Dude, voice acting, I guess. I'll, I'll plug it. I'll just text Anna and be like, hey, do you got people that need like voice this? Act. Dude, voice <laughs> acting, apparently there is. Oh, a, I'd love it. I'd have such a good time. But there's a click and there is a, um, it, it is a ruthless, I heard. In the voice acting world. <laughs> oh, really? Like there, Adam gets a lot of gigs. There's a couple of, but there's a couple of top dogs that sort of monopolize, you know, and like, especially in like the 80s and 90s where we, like, that was our fucking wheelhouse. Right. There's like two dudes that voice acted everything, especially movies, right? Mm -hmm. And so they had the monopoly on that. And, and there, there's like some fucked up, there's a whole fucking thing. There's right? this whole like underground. There's this like, whole subculture of like discrimination. Gay sex. Gay sex. Um, yeah. Really? A lot of me, we, too, a lot of me too. Crucifixions, stuff like yes. weird, like basement fight club, gay stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We just watched that. <laughs> well, all, uh, they're, all they're trying to do is voice over some cartoons. That's the fucking silly <laughs> thing about it. It's like, dude, whatever. What were you saying? Saw you got an audition. <laughs> it's like the older brother and fucking everyone loves Raymond. Yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> 
That guy's you know that guy's dudes, voice that acts guy, in a lot you of know stuff. How many yeah. dudes that guy's fucked up, probably. Yeah, dude, he, yeah, he's intimidating. <laughs> or like Joe from Family Guy. That guy. Yes, dude, <laughs> yeah. he's in a lot of shit. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> or, or like Archer. Wow, that was a bad. Yeah, was all cool. those yeah. guys. Were we saying Bob's Day? Burgers? Bob's Burgers. Yeah. yeah. Oh no, I was saying we watched. Um, I think it was on Disney Plus or something. It mm. uh, about oh. the guy that wrote all like the lyrics for like Little Mermaid and Aladdin. Wh- oh and, really? Yeah, it was just one one dude. Wow. Um, it was a documentary. Lion King. Yeah, it was pretty interesting. Oh, I want to see that. And he died pretty early. He, was, uh, he died of AIDS in like uh, the 80s. The or dude something. who voiced Sebastian just died. Just died. Yeah, Saw that's that. what it was, yeah, was kind of. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Is he a Caribbean guy? He looks like. He's, yeah. He's, Carib- a, he's a black guy. Yeah. yeah, black guy. Caribbean. He's like. Uh, I'm not something, the something right. Um, but yeah, it's interesting. This one guy that wrote all the lyrics and. Every he didn't write he wrote the music like Alan Minken or what who was like the writer the, oh yeah the yeah composer. yeah composer mm-hmm. but this guy wrote all the lyrics and pretty much did everything it's pretty impressive fuck yeah apparently well you got it you got the niche I mean the the apparently my my grandmother no no <laughs> definitely not Mamma <laughs> <laughs> my great grandmother knew you know the voice of Baloo in Jungle Book yeah. He's in a, like a lot of stuff, like in that era of right, of which Disney. was like 1950. Yeah, in the 40s too. 48, 50. Is yeah, the yeah the 40s or what? I can't remember his name, dude. But like that guy was like close with my family. Oh yeah. Yeah, and I, because they're all musicians. It's the crazy thing. Like a lot of my musical sort of lineage comes from my mom's side. A lot of singers and a shit ton of piano players. But like real legit. <gasps> Well known, sort of in the niche of the industry, not right. like a not behind Elton, the curtains. Yeah, not Elton John, right? Style or whatever. But um, like, but Louis I, fucking yes, man cub fucking song, dude. Louis man cub. Louis man cub. I look you to jungle. Oh my god, I love it. Yeah, yeah, it's a good song, dude. Uh-huh. I sang that song in eighth grade. Bucket to bucket to bucket to bucket. <laughs> Dude, is so good. When he's jump yeah, his he arm. jump his arms. So good. <laughs> that's my that's the, that's thank you. thank you. Okay, okay, okay. So off topic. It's all off topic, bro. Real quick, I wanted I just okay, so this okay, this is one of those cam um video what do we call this? Cam's corner. Oh. So you're gonna head over to Taylor's section. And you're gonna you're gonna watch this video, okay? So this before you go, okay. I'm gonna set it up. Yeah, tell okay? me what I gotta do. I'm gonna set it up. This one's not as long as the last one. This one's like less than a minute long. And so this is being pumped into my fucking Instagram feed like nobody's business. I've seen this same ad over and over again. And I want you to sort of just I'm not going to say Make whether... Make sense of it or break it down? I'm not going to say whether I think it's funny. I'm not going to say really... Actually, you know what? I'm not going to say a fucking thing. Just talk. Just, I want you to watch it. You can talk, and then we can play it again, because you're probably going to play it again. Yeah. But I want, at, at some point, I want you to tell me why you think I would have selected, for the many reasons, why I would have selected this video. Okay. Okay, so go 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 check out... Tech and Tech. this pops or- into your Instagram feed. This is an ad. This is an ad. Okay. So it's in the move. Um, here, Tay. It's on the right. It, you pull it up small. Oh, oh sorry, sorry, dude. It, yeah, you got to clear all that stuff. It's on the desktop. Oh. Oops. This is oh, an ad I'm that sorry. pops into your feed. Yes, this I need is to an... tell you why I think it did. You're, th- you're going to tell me why you think okay. I'm having you look at it. Okay. Because there's several reasons. There's actually some good shit. Hold on, hold on. Is it, um, do I need to oh, it? Right there, that. Mm-hmm. Right below it. No, click it again. You close that. Yeah, that top that top video. That, that one? That one right there. Double click it. the bottom. Okay, there you go. Oh. Do I need to wear Tay's headphones? Yeah, you yeah. need to hear. Just wear these ones. No, no, I got, got it right oh, here. Do they reach? Well, no. you, I want you to hear it too, Taylor. Oh. It's almost... It, you really, it's almost... Listenable worthy, but switch to that camera so they can see Cam. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay. You might need to listen to it a couple times. Here, you sit down, Cam.
What's up? It's Drusif. Click the link below to become a distinguished gentleman. Okay, do you want it one more time? Yeah, I do. I get, do want it get one, it one more, more time. time. I've already got three reasons. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? It's Drusif. Click the link below to become a distinguished gentleman. Okay, so for for those who are audio listeners, oh, I it's your mic. it fell off again, dude. God damn it! For those of you who are audio listeners, uh, listeners um, from Dillinger Escape Plan, um, fuck, dude. Lozenges from lozenges. Ludens. I do apologize because these things. <laughs> How nice. Uh, you, you, you kind of you're doing that Axel thing. Yeah, I'm doing it again. Yep. Um, or it, the Freddy. Dude, thing. something. Not. It's not. Okay, so. Um, again, audio listeners, go back and just go to that section of the podcast and just watch it because I am very interested. So I, I'll tell you this, that is the, it came up 10 times in really? like, it was like three times a day. That same one mm. was coming to me. And the first time I was like, mm. I was like, Oh shit, this thing's rocking. Yeah. Dude. I was like, this guy's rips. Yeah. But then I really watched it, <laughs> and then some things came up. I was wondering if anything came up for so you. So <laughs> here's here's why I think maybe it popped into your feed, and uh, why it's been. You listen to a lot of Periphery, so I do. like there's that, right? So that's one reason, right? Second reason, you've probably Googled, can fat. Guitar players shred good. <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> like, only while sitting down. <laughs> <laughs> only while sitting down in lazy place. <laughs> oh my god! I have it. Can fat, can fat guitar players shred still? <laughs> and here's here's another one. Yeah, he kind of looks like a young. Uh, his name is Robert Paulson from Fight Club. He looks like a young meatloaf. You know, I thought he because when he's like, you want to see a distinguished gentleman, like he, like his face, how he talks, looks like Meatloaf when yeah. he talks. It's Meatloaf <laughs> and the guy from American, the fat guy from American History X, fucked <laughs> and made a baby. Do you know what I'm saying? What's he selling? So he's that's a merch brand. First of all, uh, the other thing that's really silly about just that text on a shirt, dude. There was <laughs> six views. I think I had all six views. I was like, how <laughs> how did this happen? Dude, so is that was that all you got? Uh, I had one more. I, I don't remember what it was. Okay. Um, Periphery, Fat Shredders, Robert Paulson. Robert um, Paulson. <laughs> uh, can we can we agree that 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 section of the song got a freshie. was written? Oh, what's up? Look Someone at got a fresh cut. Oh, my God. My son is here again. <laughs> and we, we enlisted him in the Marines. <laughs> yep. <laughs> he's he's going, laugh it up now, bud. He's going, he's, <laughs> Wait, what the? Oh, I okay. He's going off to the military um, tomorrow, right? Oh. Where are we going tomorrow? Great Wolf Lodge. Awesome, dude. We're going to Great Wolf Lodge. Are you going to go on the big slide? Yes, but I'm scared. You're scared, but we're going to do it, right? Yes. You're going to hold on to me tight, right? That's why you got that high and tight haircut. You got that high and tight. I'm surprised you're still up. It's ten ten. What's up and, with the Christmas jammies? And you're and you're sick. How are you feeling? They're good year round. Good. Are you feeling better? 
Because you had 101.5 oh, fever. Get him out of here. Yes. Yeah. You're feeling better? Yes. <laughs> get him out of here. I want to hear the headphones. You want to hear the headphones? Yes. Oh, he's talking tonight. Yeah, he he's is. pretty good. Here, you can hear. Grab them. <laughs> They're a little sweaty. Hey. <laughs> Can you hear yourself? Say yeah. check. Say check one two. Why? Because we gotta know. Just check say, one two. Say check one two. Now he's embarrassed. <laughs> now he ain't got nothing to right. say. It, are you putting him to bed? No, only my aunt. Oh. You got your. Hu- Just came to get him. Okay. All right, got say, your high and tight here, ready oh, for the here, big here, slide. Here, here, here. You know what I want you to say? You know what I want you to say? What? Say thank you for watching the Dick and Boonies podcast. <laughs> All right, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. I love you. Char char. Blow it up. Later, brother. Give Taylor yeah. a blow up. Oh, no, you're oh. infected. <laughs> he is infected. Um, I think we can both agree that that section of the song rips. That's a pretty, yeah, ri- that's a rippy ass. Yeah. Especially the second part. When yeah. he goes in that, diddly diddly, that part fucking rips. Yeah, and he's got one of those toast and a bossy fucking yeah. shredders. So he, I bet that's popped up on Jeffy's feed as many times as sure. three and three. <laughs> yeah, he's got three views. I got three views. The, the, okay, so if you if you go back and watch it again, so when he does his fucking bobs, dude, he comes up. It's a different face each time. He he. So he he bobs down. It's like this. He goes. He goes Oh, he changes his face every time he comes up. I was like, dork! Dorkus! Come on, you dorky! Come on! And I was dying, so I watched it so many times. <laughs> and it's probably up to like 30 views now. <laughs> but I watched it so many times, I was laughing so fucking hard. And then, and then, I finally like tuned in, really, and he's like, my name's Drusif. Drusif, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, Jerusalem. What Jerusalem. name, dude? What name? Whose name is that? It's not yeah, your whose name. Is Nobody's that? name is Jerusalem. <laughs> yeah, dude. And I, I, so I died laughing because I go, he goes, I'm Jerusalem, and he's trying to be a hard dude. Right? Yeah. Trying, it's like I'm Jerusalem. I'm Looking like, like a young meatloaf. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, bro, you can't be hard if your name is Jerusalem, dude. That one's. Good. I go, that's fake. It's fake, right? So I looked him up. First name? Birth. This this dude is fucking killing it. So <laughs> there, there, there are some How people. How old is he? Dude, I don't know. He doesn't look old. He looks 28. Yeah. You know? Fat it, ages a little he's, bit. You know? He's doing good. Like, I was like, oh, man, if we do talk about this. I, I knew we were going to talk about it on the podcast because I fucking. Drewsif. I was like, Drewsif. Dude, just change your. Dude, just be Drew. Yeah. Or, or, or Joseph. Hey, Joseph, uh, <laughs> can you come here and uh, help me with the lemonade? Hey, Joseph. God, dude. But when you watch it, I want you to watch it again. Mom, like, Dad, this is Joseph. <laughs> dude, when he. Dad's like. <laughs> The I'm gonna fuck? name him Drusif. <laughs> yeah, can we call you Drew? <laughs> I, okay, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. Uh, <laughs> so Sorry, he seems retarded when he's playing. There's a little bit of a. There's some. Tar- there's like. There's a kink in there's, there. There's some tar. There's a glitch. There's a, there's a bit of tar happening, and if you look, if you really look. When he's fucking killing it, yeah. dude, straight tard. There's a thing. There's a full tard, a full tard thing happening. And I've said it so many goddamn times now, I can't even bleep it. We're just gonna have to yeah. leave it. Yeah. But like the reality is like I just it it's it was it was hilarious to me. <laughs> I at first, dude, at first I was like, this is ripping. It it, it does rip. It's ripping hard. Mm-hmm. And dude, and then I went down this fucking wormhole. What's distinguished gentlemen? Just a it's merch just a brand, just a, a merch brand. brand. Yeah, and like apparently, and Drusif is killing it. The laziest. <laughs> That's for guys that wear like fedoras and shit, right? Yes, yeah. he does have that vibe, and right? You know who does? It? You know what guys who wear fedoras don't wear those shirts that he's wearing. No, they do. Distinguished gentlemen. Yeah. Oh, is that a thing? Yeah. Like I like dorky fedora guys. You know, like me lady. F- yeah. Fedor. Fedorks. 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 <laughs> You heard it here. <laughs> so I just thought you might. I was like, there's lots of things about this that Cam could like appreciate. <laughs> dude, but the Bob, dude, when he was, he comes up and he's got, he's smiling. Like, <laughs> dude, you know how, like, when you're free. You've when already you, said it. When you're a free spirit. 
<laughs> you know when you're like a total free spirit? <laughs> And like you're not great at like um, processing information. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, that smile is, dude. He does it so good. There are sections of that where he's bobbing because he's in. He's he comes up from each bob in a different phase. I didn't. I didn't so notice of, the different personalities that were coming up from dude, each bob. Look, we gotta watch it one more time. I got it. Uh, and yeah, it's, it's 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 in the first section. Okay, play it again, Tay Tay. It's in the first section, and he does the. <laughs> Watch his face, okay? Already. What's up? It's Drew. Oh, and then, okay, pause that, pause that, pause that. Dude. Why so serious? Why so serious? Well, Yo, what's he's up? He's playing. He's playing some fucking ripping shit. He's That's true. Scary. Okay, so he's not a totally different face every time he bobs, but no. the but the smile, dude. Yes, <laughs> dude the- watching this is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yes. His name is Robert Paulson. <laughs> okay, hold on. Yeah, rewind this shit. <laughs> Wait. Okay, here we go, here we go. There are so many other places he should Ooh. be that aren't in his oh, chair. God. What are his shits like, dude? Oh, yeah. They, Why is he sitting down? Dude, yeah. He's fucking, dude, he's producing. This is just on his off hours. <laughs> <laughs> That's him shitting. So you can see if you're <laughs> watching. What are his do, your, oh. do, do your, uh, um, what's your impression of your fucking... What? Uh, English guy that I can't think of the name. Oh, um, David Attenborough. <laughs> it's too quiet. Did you hear that ring? Yeah. That's the ring for my new baby. Oh, That's my no. new bye bye. Oh, you're going to scare her off. Dude. That is a ripping thing. But he, he, okay, so I just, dude, I can't, I couldn't help it. Do His, we know that he doesn't have fa- like legs? That's my maybe? Maybe. No, no, no. Oh, I don't know. No, he's got legs. Oh, maybe he's maybe he's actually is, is retarded. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> mustard. He's got a couple of mustards. <laughs> or mustard. Oh boy. And this oh, is yeah. Hey, nice. You got him good there. Yeah, where? <laughs> nice. Dude. Yeah, dude, that's yeah. what I'm saying, dude. That's what he looks like. It's that face. God, yeah, dude. Sure. Okay. Okay, get back to work. It smells like <laughs> T ball nachos and fucking <laughs> Airheads. He's got a nice uh, studio set up back there with that big screen and shit and that speaker. He's distinguished gentleman though. Yeah. Mm. I mean, I would like to play guitar as yeah, good as I f- would love to be that good. But then actually the craziest fucking thing is that s- through that I navigated down the fucking gnarliest that I was really thinking about you hard as I was navigating <laughs> through <laughs> You were thinking about me. Wow, hard. Wild hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, but I was thinking about you in a in a deep, sincere way when I was I went on a wormhole. I don't usually wormhole on Instagram. That's usually for different things for me. That guy. Are you? Oh, oh gotcha. Yeah. yeah. So through that, I weren't like somebody. I can't remember how it happened, but like another. Uh, somehow I got to animal uh, animals as as leaders. Yeah. And then. You go through his page, and then other good guitar players will say, comment, and then I'll click on their page. And I went through, and I was like, it is absolutely absurd, the yeah. skill level. Yeah, the prog rock fucking guitar levels right now are just insane. It, it's beyond... So here, And then you think, and you think to yourself, you go, corn? <laughs> yeah. Level of success? Mm-hmm. Um, stardom, fame... Yeah. Recognition, yeah. and then you go, you you go, hey monkey, play this riff. Yeah, play some Polyphia. <laughs> and he, and they're twenty, and his fucking balls will explode. Yeah, like they'll have no. Clue. They're not even twenty. They're eighteen years old. I mean, animals as leaders. That no, guy. but I'm talking about like <clears throat> some of these prog rock bands. Yeah, like these guitar players are fucking young. They're just shit. ripping. They're ripping. Ripping. And there's this. Um, there's this. There's a bunch of really young. T- I don't. Okay, the acoustic guitar where they rip and they're but they're 
tapping all that shit. Mm-hmm. The boom, and they're doing all that. I'm like, okay, whatever. You can tell they're they're highly skilled musicians. But I'm like, just take the tapping out. We don't need any of the tapping. I don't need it. That's just sort of like a a shtick. Wow factor. Yeah, I don't I don't get that. To me, like the tapping part doesn't add anything. I know it's hard. Mm-hmm. So I guess that's cool. It's this Mauricio, Mauricio something or or something. Young kid. He's this young guy. Yeah. He does really great covers. He'll do anything from like Metallica to fucking Britney Spears. You right. know what I mean? Yeah. Um, and I've seen that guy. Yeah, cute little guy. Yeah. He's like fourteen. And or he something. throws down. Throws it's down great. hard. Yeah. And sometimes he does this little. <laughs> like if he's doing like uh, every once in a while he'll do like a system of a down cover and he'll be like. I'm like, dude, you don't know <laughs> shit. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so, but I went down this wormhole and I was like, it, it does sort of, if you think about the most famous bands. Sure. The most popular, the most uh, well-received bands, yeah. more often than not, they're not the most technically sound sure. gentlemen. Yeah. And then these guys are just ripping. Yeah. What's the disconnect? Is it too complex for like the the normal ear? It's not pop music. No, it, it, right. So it's just not catchy. Yeah, I mean, it's, no, not at all. And that's, to, so and, and that's so fucked up. And that's what it comes down so, to. So skill doesn't doesn't equate to love. No, no. And that's it hasn't up. for a long time. I know, but I just some I of wanna... those guys might not be able to write a pop song, which is pretty hard to do. That's okay. So I guess Writing that... a pop song is not fucking easy. I guess like, that angle is that's people think it is, but it's not. You're right. That's yeah. that's true. That that angle is correct. It just it does. So I don't know. There was many times where I, I just have never been confident in anything that I've ever done. So I because th- I'm constantly comparing earlier in the podcast, I'm just constantly comparing myself mm. to other people. And you go. But then I was like, how the fuck does monkey like feel like how does he lay down well, at night knowing that these guitar players are just ripping? Well, I mean, he kind of they kind of pioneered a thing. You know what I mean? It was kind of new. Like they you, did a thing that wasn't really heard before they got the seven string they kind of threw down different than rock bands before them you know they kind of related to like the new corn did a thing that was new so they so they were innovative yeah being like they were innovative or what because you just can't even if you but we also don't know that monkey can't throw down we can i know we know yeah, you I, think? Th- I think we know. You think so? I, I mean, even Wes, I love him to death. He'll yeah. never, he'll never see this because he doesn't fucking care. <laughs> but um, another guy, just a pioneer, took, you know, sure. almost like okay, ja- um, Jack White. Mm-hmm. He's another one. He he got yeah. like number one in like Guitar Magazine. Yeah, but he's creative. He's right. creative, and I. But but it just you go. Here you go, Jack White. Fucking right. take this section of the song. Let's see you even. What will you? Your head will explode. I mean, it. It's all relative. It's all practicing something, right? Like if you sat there and practiced those riffs as much as those kids probably have. Like you think Jack White? No, I'm not. I'm not talking about that sort of style. I'm talking about like the prog rock stuff. Yeah, that's all very just sitting there and practice you know, like the to sweep. death. You're not just good at that stuff because it's all it's all hand and No, you earn it. You, I mean you're you, just pr- you're you, just practicing it. So it's all relative. You know, right. you're practicing something else or something else. I think it's but see I would love to sit in that thought and be okay with it. You know, because to me it just seems like well, there's oh this le- caliber of musician yeah. and then everybody else. And all the musicians, all the guitar players that I was filtering through, going mm. down that wormhole, they all fucking are just deadly. You know what I mean? Mm. Precision, mm-hmm. exact. Every fucking like fret was like right in the middle. Yeah, it's, it's almost like, not <laughs> human. It's almost just machine. You're yeah, like, you have the capability to do it. It's just you. It might take you longer to, to learn. Right. right. Yeah. And if you talk to Adam Jones or Monkey or Steph Carpenter. Right. They are okay with it. They are. They're okay with it. Yeah, they're fine. You, you and they also they even say it. They even recognize Adam Jones it. is like, dude, I'm not a shredder. No. You know? Yeah. But I'm it, fucking tool, you know. Yeah. You're like, just fucking tool. You're good. Yeah. Okay. Like that's that's all right. Are you playing it's music like, for everybody else or yourself? I guess. Right. Exactly. That that's exactly right. 
I don't know. It just it just because those guys are clearly not trying to sell out arenas. No, you know they're just they're just that musically involved, and they have to do it. They're they're okay. They have to do it. You know what? Somebody just connected with me. So there are comedians that are very specifically trying to make other comedians laugh. They're they're so cerebral. Or the 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 thought idea is so not universal, mm -hmm. but very comedian esque, like within a comedian's brain. Mm -hmm. They don't give a fuck, and they're the ones that aren't doing that great. That have like right. thirteen hundred, you know, followers on Instagram because, but they make every comedian laugh. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Comedians get around, but that's not what fucking pays the bills, right? You know exactly. And so you have to sort of. If you can be that That's magical. That's why Glassjaw is not fucking huge. Right. But it's they're a, pretty big. They're, they're pretty big. big. Yeah. They're pretty, but but they, that's they not are. why they don't have core, that's not why they don't have core numbers. Right. Well, it's because it's not pop music. It's, right. It's, so is corn pop? I mean, kind yeah. of. Pop I mean, rock, in, yeah. in, the, in the grand scheme of things, yeah. yeah. Now, I mean, not when it came out, but now it's pop. Totally. Right. But, yeah. but you can put Glassjaw at the whiskey. You can't put corn at the whiskey. You know, it's just, it's just what it is. Like it's interesting because I feel like I am I my talent more aligns with the corn genre, like era. Like I feel like there's not a chance that anything that I ever could do would be that intricate and detailed. Mine is more of like a I can be more universal, and part of me goes. That's a really good quality to have because you can um, be attractive to a larger majority of people. But then I'm also like, but then the the people I respect will be laughing at me. That's what it is. Because you have bands like Chevelle, mm -hmm. right, that most bands sort of laugh at because it's so basic. But then they write these songs that are so fucking catchy mm -hmm. that everyone can relate to and connect to. And it's, you yeah. know, you just got to figure out that self-consciousness well, that yeah, you have right. that's impeding yeah. and holding you back. I know it kind of makes me, it, it's weird every once in a while, those kinds of thoughts like, le like leech into like the political thing. And I start to think about, and I'm not saying anything, but like Trump had a more universally liked, um, ideology mm -hmm. in the United States. Mm -hmm. That's why he was able to, you know, fucking be president for four fucking years. Mm -hmm. Some of the things that he was saying appealed to f a, f a far larger majority of the country. Mm -hmm. And uh, not, I don't really know if he, he, you know, came through on any of the things that he said. I really don't. I, I, I have never really seen much of a difference in this country based on the president that we've had. There's and, been some things. I mean, there's been some things, but nothing. Have you seen this? I think it's affecting me. Who is that? Is that Ric Flair? It's the new, uh, new Brett creation for your birthday. Oh my God, am I Ric Flair? Oh my, what is? That? <laughs> is that Ric Flair? Yeah. <laughs> I like, Fuck, I haven't seen it yet. God, his creations are amazing. He's already got his. Oh, did he post it? You haven't seen it. I haven't seen it yet. No. Oh my I God. Maybe we can just use that for the for the episode. <laughs> yeah. Woo! <laughs> All right. Uh, we did it. Cool. Nice. That's it. We're all that done. That was fun. That was fun. Hey, happy birthday. Thanks, happy brother. birthday, Cameron. Fucking love you, Thanks, man. Thanks, guys. Sorry, sorry I didn't get you something. You, you we'll, we'll, we'll take you out to dinner, brother. We're yeah. here. I'm we're, here. We're here. We're here, dude. Yeah. You honestly like You actually brought wine. <laughs> yeah. So, so you you pitched in. Yeah, but I usually do. I know, but you know, I don't know. You you host. I, I bring the you bring the wine I bring the wine dude. that's hilarious that's a pretty good I think that's a pretty good deal <sighs> wasn't that guy funny though wasn't his face funny <laughs> he was Can I you... just I thought periphery Robert Paulson okay that's what I thought man I was laughing hard dude I laughed <laughs> hard I really thought there I saw something that maybe wasn't there and I just wanted it to be there <coughs> but I laughed. you saw some shit that I didn't see yeah because he because you saw up. like the mouth he just, While yes. he was jamming and doing this, and I think I saw it too. And I was, but like, I feel like it came up. And then I was like, a God. Lot. And I was like, dude, you I fuck, your name is Jerusalem, dude. Jerusalem. I guess we have a, a title for the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Cam turns Jerusalem. <laughs> we got real in Jerusalem. <laughs>
I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Yeah. All right. I love you. Love you. I too. love you, Tay. Love you too. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. Woo! Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.